a young couple are on their way to Vegas to get married. Before getting there, the girl says to the guy that she has a confession to make. The reason that they have not been too intimate is because she's very flat chested. If he wishes to cancel the wedding, it's okay with her. The guy thinks about it for a while and says he does not mind. That she's flat and this is not the most important thing in a marriage. Several miles down the road, the guy turns to the girl and says that he also wants to make a confession. He says that below his waist, he's just like a baby. If the girl wants to cancel the marriage, it's okay with him. The girl thinks about it for a while and says that she does not mind, and that she also believes there are other things far more important than in the marriage. They are happy that they are honest with each other and go on to Vegas and get married. On their wedding night, the girl takes off her clothes. She is as flat as a washboard. Finally, the guy takes off his clothes. One glance at the guy's body and the girl faints and falls to the floor. After she regains consciousness, the guy says, I told you before we get married. Why did you still faint? The girl says, you told me it was just like a baby. The guy replies, yes, 8 pounds and 21 inches. The <laughs> man wakes up one morning with the worst hangover and no recollection of the night before. Slowly opening his eyes, he sees a bottle of aspirin and a glass of water on the beside table. He looks around the room to find his clothes are neatly folded on the dresser with a clean shirt on top. The bedroom is immaculate. On the beside table is a note that says, Darling, your breakfast is in the kitchen. I love you. Downstairs, he finds his favorite cereal, croissant, fresh OJ, and freshly brewed coffee waiting for him, along with the morning paper and his 15-year-old son, who is finishing his own breakfast. Tell me, son, he asks, what happened last night? Well, says the boy, you came home so drunk you didn't even know your own name. You nearly broke the door down. Then you were sick in the hallway. Then you knocked the furniture over and when mom tried to calm you down, you thought she was the police. So you gave her a black eye. Christ, says the man. Then how come my clothes are folded, the house is tidy and my breakfast is ready? When mom dragged you into the bedroom and tried to get your pants off to put you into your bed, you shouted at her. Get your filthy hands off of me. You I'm married. Yeah. <laughs>